All right, so we're checking Dr. Evan here today. Let's start with checking leg length, seeing if there is any inversion or eversion strain which could indicate cord torsion or tension. I'm picking up a little bit more on the right side going through the calf into the back of the knee. So checking more of right side ilium lumbars. We have a little bit more glute tension, a little bit more hamstring tension. How does that change as we connect to the spine? I'm connecting more at the L5 level. So again, picking up what I picked up on the leg led me more to the right side of the low back. I have an L5 that I want to adjust that has a level of compression in rotation. So go ahead and go this side up for me. Boom, let's go. So connecting the L5, putting the pressure in through the palm, in through the sink, and then checking, does it want more of a clockwise or counterclockwise rotation? Does it want to open up? Right there is perfect. So this is where the facet starts to open up. I'll roll the entire body as a group, and then adjust through, Boom. face down, it's perfect. So for those of you that have been with me a while from uh, YouTube land and wherever else, we've done a lot of chiropractor chiropractor flows and we're gonna be doing those still, but also now being able to talk through them as well. A little bit more educational. So I'm following up that track, that line. It's leading me to my next area, which is gonna be about the T, T8, T9 level. There's a compression happening here. So basically uh, the T8, T9 compressing here. So I'm figuring out how to unwind that and then adjust through it. So I'm gonna lift the vertebra above off the vertebra below and then adjust through. Sweet. Breath is an integrator. So T2 here. Right there. Perfect. On your back. There are some keys there to be mindful of, which we teach at our Kairos Training Culture Level 1 training camp. And then we're going to check out lower neck C6 on the right side. Come up here through the posterior to anterior. Awesome. And last one, C2 with opening up occiput on the right side. So occiput's going A to P, C2 is gonna come up through. There it was. Whew. All right, I'll recheck the legs here. We got a second or third cuneiform that's jammed superior. It's so good. Legs are balanced. All set. Boom. <laughs> What's going on? I'm Dr. Evan with the Source Chiropractic and we take care of each other here. So I'm gonna check Dr. Brett's nervous system as he's coming back from an Achilles tendon rupture. So let's see what we got going on here. So checking heel tension, there's an obvious difference from the side that he injured uh, on the left side. So there's a decreased tone in his left, left calf. And he's been putting a lot of weight on this right leg. So I'm gonna come up the right side here. And check that right pelvis. So I, as I feed into the pelvis, I can feel his sacrum is torqued to the left and dropping into his pelvis on the left here. So I need to make an opening so that I can, the left side can open and the right side can drop through and we can establish a neutral. We got some L5, L4 involvement too. We'll put them on the side and have you go this side up, Dr. Brett. So first thing, always finding ease in his system and creating a space where he can feel nice and comfy and I can drop an adjustment through. So as I feed into the sacrum here, it doesn't like being tractioned in, so it wants to be brought up like that. So I'm gonna roll him through here and then drop straight through. Oh, yeah. Okay, face down. Mm. So we just wanna double check our work and see how we did. So nice and immediate change in the right side. And this is nice and balanced now, so I like that. So we'll move up. 
as I rock through, I can feel he's getting caught right at this TL junction. So L1, T12 here. So I'm gonna roll up on T12 and drop L1 straight through. Oh, yeah, buddy. We got a nice breath there, so we got some movement. Beautiful, it's nice and cleared. We got our right side rib cage torsion as well. So as this rib cage drops out laterally, we're gonna bring it through right there. <clears throat> Beautiful. Have you flip over on your back, brother. So we have compression down the base of his neck on the right side here. And we're gonna clear that with a nice anterior push at C6. So drop that straight through. Bring him back to neutral a little bit. Beautiful. And that didn't really clear the way I want to, so I'm gonna go ahead and give it a pull here. There it is. And that's it. Dr. Brett's clear. What we do here is go back, 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 back.